always prepared. The United States Coast Guard, a little shout out for them, by the way. How about, isn't your mother with the Coast Guard? Rosanna, you are correct. Uh, my <laughs> mom is a veteran of the United States Coast Guard. What she is spent, her position, uh, petty officer? I think she was a petty chief. officer. A, a, a chief. Higher is better than lower. So. Okay. okay. Yeah. Senior chief. Uh, you know, I, I called her mom in those days, <laughs> but uh, she would put on the uniform on weekends and go off to Yorktown, Virginia, or sometimes to the uh, base in the Rockaways and uh, and serve. It, I was, I'm very proud of her. That it's a branch so cool. of service, though, that many people don't know. Go all over the world to man the ports and open the ports for the military wherever they go, and they serve side by side, even though sometimes you say, well, the Department of Transportation or Homeland Security, they are part of the Joint Chiefs. Mm -hmm. All right, we have some special guests right now. Let's go to Elise. Thank you, Rosanna. I'm here with Command Sergeant Major Laughlin over at Fort Hamilton in Brooklyn. Can you tell us a little bit about what it's like serving at Fort Hamilton and how Fort Hamilton is honoring service? I absolutely can. Um, what it's like, Fort Hamilton is the greatest installation I've ever been at because it's in New York City, the greatest city in the nation. And how we honor it also is the most patriotic. And I can say that because I've been around the world a couple of times and back. But how we're honoring is that yesterday we had a Veterans Day program as well, and we honored veterans from World War II all the way to the current conflict. We allowed them to share their stories. We gave them salutes. We had a reception and every day is Veterans Day at Fort Hamilton because we believe they deserve the quality of service commensurate with the quality of service that they gave. So quality of life for their families, whether they're retirees, uh, active duty, everything in between is our mission on Fort Hamilton and it's what we do best because we love our veterans, we love our active duty, and we love our DA, DOD civilians who serve right alongside us. So thank you so much. Well, thank you so much for your service and thank you for your wonderful words. We love having you here today. Thank you. I appreciate back it. Back to you, Rosanna and Greg. All right. Thank you so much. Fort no, Hamilton. There's some stuff way at the back. You can see the flags coming. All right. Did so you see the White Plains High School? They didn't come too far, but we're happy that they're here. We sure are. And guess who's still watching this parade? <laughs> General David Petraeus retired, the current director of the Central Intelligence Agency. And John Zuccotti, who's standing to his right, who uh, is one of the grand marshals of the parade today and also uh, involved with Brookfield Properties and Zuccotti Park, where uh, they are, have occupied. I, I believe the park is named after his family, and uh, yeah, he's now internationally famous. And John Zuccotti was also a deputy mayor in New Correct. York. Again, uh, General Petraeus there on the right with the baseball cap on. Uh, many credit him with really turning things out around in Iraq, uh, architect of the surge. Of course, he uh, served in Afghanistan as well and continues to serve his country as director of the Central Intelligence Agency. Paul, you know uh, uh, General Petraeus I've very known, well. I've known Dave since he was 17 years old, and I've known his wife, Holly, since she was about 12. Do you call him P4? I call him Dave. <laughs> <laughs> and now, by the way, his wife, Holly, I believe, was the daughter of the superintendent of West Point. Yes. And that's when you knew Dave was going to go far. <laughs> <laughs> he started dating the general's daughter while he was a student at West that Point. That sounds correct. like a movie, The General's Daughter. <laughs> All right, we're coming back with more of the New York City Veterans Day Parade. Shout out to the troops. Happy Veterans Day. Thank you guys for everything you do. Um, what we do is so much less important, yet we have this silly night for it. But happy Veterans Day to you guys. Thanks. God bless you all. I know how brave you are and how important it is for you to keep fighting for our country. I love you all. Be safe.